you know, we got beat by a team today that, that you know, was opportunistic. Um, you know, they, they, they created big plays, which is something uh, whenever you go into a first game, you know, that's the thing that you got to, that we were kind of worried about. Uh, you know, offensively, we didn't do a very good job of keeping our defense off the field, sustaining drives. Um, thought we missed a couple opportunities here and there. But uh, yeah, I don't want you to know this. We, we've got a very good football team, all right? And I believe in our football team. I believe in the commitment. I believe in what they've uh, done. We've got a ways to go. I get it, OK? I get it, OK? I got shoulders. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it all. But I do. I believe in this football team, and I think we've got a lot of good things to look forward to. Um, you know, obviously containing and busting a couple coverages, uh, you know, on, on, on their number six, it, you know, guys, you can't do that. <laughs> you know, that's not a good deal. Let some guy that runs that fast just run down the sideline on you. But, uh, you know, and then the, the, the fumble, actually, they were opportunistic. They had a good strip and uh, took it down in and, and sealed it. So, you know, I never felt we were out of it uh, by any stretch of imagination. Um, you know, field position a little bit. Um, we, we, we've got to get better than that. Had an opportunity to get a first down coming off the goal line. Didn't do it. Um, so there's a lot of things. And, and we'll learn from this. We'll learn from this. Give them credit. Uh, thought their quarterback played, played one heck of a game. I really do. Um, you know, he was accurate, got the ball out of his hand. We didn't get much pass rush. Uh, give their offensive lineman uh, credit there. Um, and, um, you know, I'm disappointed, to be honest with you. I thought we'd win the game, okay? And uh, I still believe I still believe in these guys, and I think we're a good football team. You know, I, our guys were prepared. They were energized. Uh, they hung in there. Um, you know, we didn't overcome big plays, obviously. And, uh, you know, we let, left a lot of offense out on the field, which is something we got to get uh, remedied. You know, I, 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 I know this. We, we've, uh, we've done some good things. Um, we've got to get better in a lot of phases. Um, and, and uh, you know, I didn't think we ran the ball as much as possibly we should have, you know, as far as controlling the line of scrimmage. Uh, I'll be honest there. Um, something we've got to step back and evaluate a little bit because um, we were just on the edge of hitting some big runs too, uh, which would have kept our defense off the field probably a little bit. Jim? You know, he'd like to have a couple of the plays back, but I thought he managed it pretty well. I really do. Uh, you know, missed a couple plays, made a couple plays with his feet. Um, you know, we didn't probably push the ball down the field enough, you know, to be – Honest, we we probably, you know, there were some seams in there that that uh, we didn't take advantage of. So I thought we were kind of everything was horizontal uh, today. So that's something we need to look at. And um, you know, he, he he did all right. How about winning the quarterback derby? What uh, went into that? You know, I think uh, you know, we felt based off of his uh, really his preparation and and. Uh, he took control of our one reel, and, and uh, I think he was ready. And, and uh, you know, I'm not putting his loss on Garrett by any stretch of imagination. As far as the running goes, uh, you know, you had Alexander go down with an injury early. Yeah, did Donnell. You step up? Yeah, Bibbs did all right. Um, what did you like of his game besides the injury? You know, he had a little juice. I'd like to see him keep his feet. Thought he could have hit a couple home runs, actually, keeping his feet. Um, but, you know, we put one on the ground. Can't do that uh, and play successful football. But but he did. He came in and energized us a little bit. And uh, you know, Donnell, we got to take a look at that hand and, and see kind of what's what's going to happen there. Yeah, yeah, you know, and I thought our kickoff coverage was much better. Um, and I thought we obviously made some explosive plays in the special teams. Uh, and we worked hard on it. And uh, you know it's one of those phases of the game that you have to be good at, and 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 I thought we uh, we did some pretty good things. Obviously, there it was really it's what got us in the game to begin with, and and uh, you know it was good. Yeah, I thought Joe 
tweaked his ankle there a little bit at the end. You know, we'll see if he's going to be ready to go next week. But uh, I think he sh he showed up big. He, you know, he showed up like the Colorado Gator Aid Player of the Year, like he was. And uh, you know what? I'm, I'm I'm proud of him because he came and really competed. And we, you know, our guys have been through a lot. They they they've come together. Um, the guys, the beauty of athletics. You know, the, the beauty of sport. You know, there's got to be a winner and there's a, there's there's going to be a loser. And the life lessons that you learn and how you pick yourself up and go forward. Um, you know what? I think we'll have some resolve. I really do. And uh, you know, it hurts, guys. I mean. And, and I still think we should win the game. And I'm going to tell you, I think we should win the game next year. So go ahead and put it in their locker room now, okay? That's what I believe, okay? I do. And uh, I'm, I'm good with that because I know they got my back and I got their back. And that's something that's real comforting as a coach.